Tara, the bill was authored by State Representative Dave Heine. And so what this bill will do is give those with bachelor's degrees essentially a way to go back to school to become educators all within a 10 to 12 month time period while still simultaneously working in a classroom. Their search for new teachers, East Allen County Schools Superintendent Marilyn Hisong says sometimes the right candidate is already in the classroom. They're just not always teachers yet. Paras, they're substitute teachers, or maybe they're on a teaching um, emergency permit. And then as we look at them and consider them for positions, if they want to do the transition to teaching program, then our principals have had some time to observe them. The transition to teaching scholarship enables people with bachelor's degrees to become full-time teachers within a year. His song says they've had a lot of success doing this in their schools, including New Haven Intermediate School. Principal Mandy Barker says they need assistance in more areas than others. We've been impacted, um, especially uh, with some of our special uh, ed students in the special needs department. Uh, we have that's where we've been primarily using the scholarship, uh, and where we have the transition to teaching. What's great about it is that you know people who are adults and who've already got getting, gotten one degree have realized that their passion is with kids and that they want to be doing something else. In the last year, 18 of 29 applicants have received the scholarship and his song says the state providing more money will only mean more teachers. So we were very excited about those numbers. The other 11 students we were able to fund through our Title II monies, which we will not be able to maintain that over time. So we are so excited that they're investing more money into this program. That will help more students, obviously, who down the road want to be teachers. And upon completion of this program, the teachers are committing to working at least five years within the school district. Now, coming up at 6 p.m., you're going to hear more from Dave Heine. Until then, live at New Haven Intermediate School, I'm Troy Grant, Fox 55 News.